Hi, I'm Stephanie Bergaman with Chef Stephanie Personal Chef Services, and I'm here today to teach you a little bit about cooking some delicious salmon. We've got beautiful salmon filet here. We're just putting it on a baking sheet with a little bit of oil underneath it just to keep it from sticking. All you really have to do with salmon is give it a little bit of flavor. Salmon has great flavor as it is, so you just want simple salt, pepper. We'll do some herbs as well. So I'm just doing a little bit of thyme. You can cook salmon a couple different ways. You can put it in the oven roasted about 425, or you can even do it at a slow roast, 275 for about 40 minutes. We're gonna do a higher roast. We're gonna do 475 today. For the salmon, we're going to make a charred lemon vinaigrette. With seafood, I really love to add acid. It's a basic vinaigrette, but we're going to intensify um, the sweetness by charring it in a cast iron skillet. So you can just pull them off when they have a nice golden color on them. So any vinaigrette, no matter what flavor pro profile you want to go with, I always start with minced shallots, just like onions. So take off the stem ends, slice it in half, we're gonna do slices like this, and then do a few vertical cuts this way. And this way, all your shallot pieces kind of stay together, everything is uniform. Take all of this, put it in your mixing bowl. This is those charred lemons that we made earlier. Basic ratio for vinaigrette is three parts oil to one part acid. Acid can be lemon juice, it can be red wine vinegar, white wine vinegar, balsamic. I always like to add a little bit of honey because it just balances it. Just stir that together. Always salt your greens. Pretty much salt everything. And we'll do a little bit of pepper as well. The best way to dress a salad is to drizzle your vinaigrette around the edges of your bowl. If you dump it directly on top, sometimes it can wilt the greens a little too much and just toss everything together and just put your greens onto whatever platter you want your salmon to go to. We're gonna let the heat of the salmon wilt all of the greens so that you have this nice warm salad. So our salmon has been in the oven for about 10 or 15 minutes. So you'll just take your salmon and go directly from the oven to the salad, and like I said, the heat of the salmon is just gonna help wilt some of those greens just a little bit. We'll finish up with just drizzling everything with a little bit more of that charred lemon vinaigrette. For meals prepared by me personally, visit Chef Stephanie on artizone.com.